we are going to learn about how to update a database using Hibernate. In Hibernate, there are two methods are available for updating a database. First one is you can get that object from the database and you can modify the properties of that object and when you call the commit method using transaction, Hibernate will automatically update that object. And the second approach is you can create an object with the same ID and you can uh, modify the field and after that you can call the update method using session object. So here in this example I am going to show the first method. So here I am going to update the first row of data. Here the first row we started with ID 125. Now here I am going to update the address field of the first row of data using Hibernate. So open Eclipse and here I am going to create a new method for updating the table. So public void update info Okay, we need object like configuration, session factory. Okay, here we need object of configuration, session factory, transaction, etc. are needed. So I copy all these code segments and paste it on the newly created method. Okay, now here I am going to delete the first row of data that means object with id 125 so first we have to access that object so object ob object ob equal to using the session object session dot load our project class name is data provider data provider dot class the second argument new integer new integer our id is 125 ok now we got an object corresponding to the first row, row in the in that table now i have to assign this object into an object of pojo class so pojo class name is data provider data provider dp equal to ob of course we need to cast it here into data provider because these are objects okay now i am going to change the property of this object i'm going to change the address here the address is highly part i'm going to change that one so dp dot set method name is set user address I change the address as Dubai okay so after that I'm going to call the commit method transaction object using transaction object so when we call the commit method the Hibernate will automatically update the database okay and finally we need to close the session so session dot close now we need to close the session factory okay here show a here show a message that the data is updated object updated successfully okay that's enough okay now we can check it uh, now here the address field is the address corresponding to the first row is highly part now we change update in into Dubai so I run the application run us Java application okay go to console I think there is an exception is yeah schema update complete we can check it out on the okay we can check it on the table select 
start from user info now it is not updated there is something exception is available we have to check it out yeah we we forget something actually here we forget something uh, we have to call the method in the main method actually now the code run is the delete method, delete so uh, it is show the correct exception because there is no such row is available for delete so uh, we have to call the correct method from the uh, main method here the our method name is update info that is our method name okay uh, now we can run the application uh, run us java application now look at the console okay object updated successfully now we can check it out in the database select start from user info okay now here the database is updated now change the uh, address field of the first row into dubai this is the one approach one method used in hibernate to update the database so here uh, we just access that object Yeah, here we just access that object and we just change the property of that object here we just change the address and after I just call the commit method then hibernate will automatically update the database okay 